All right, what's up guys? Welcome back to FTL Multiverse, our third run, part two. We have just entered into an Orchid sector, and we are we're doing well. We're playing as the stealth equivalent ship. Um, okay, let's get going. So the Orchids are a peaceful race. Yep, we know this. Okay, we got the guard. Let's contact them. They usually, usually are nice here. And we will request supplies, I guess. Okay, well, they have nothing this time. That's fine. We, we got pretty lucky most times. Ooh. One, an outpost. A Federation outpost. Okay, we're going to go one ship and then to the outpost to try to get more money to go to the store. We could actually go even more. One, two, three, and then four. We'll probably do that. Let's see what we got, though. Um, so it's a mercenary. I, I love these designs, dude. We're just going to fight him. He has level 2 shields, but that shouldn't be a problem. That should not be a problem. With a pre-ion, I think we're going to be alright. So, let's get ready here. Fire this on their shields. Nice, it just took them all the way down. Hell yeah. Put both of our lasers on here and put this on their, the beam on their weapons. We'll cloak. 80% dodge. Nice. Okay, and just like that, we're, we're good to go. We can just keep pressure on their shields. Nice resist. Oh, this is a rock ship. I didn't even notice. Pit, uh, switch the focus beam onto their shields. I don't want them to get them back. There we go. Breach. That's huge, dude. The breach is so good. It prevents them from fixing this further. I love it. All right. Their missiles are back online, but we should be able to get a cloak off before it actually fires. So we'll wait. Here we go. 80% again. Nice. Easy. Easy clap. Hell yeah. Okay. One less ship full of scum to deal with. Our crew's almost back at full health, because we're a clone bay. Nice. So let's go to the outpost, see what's happening. I think we might have been to one of these before. Again, it's been a little bit since I played this mod, but I think we... Yeah, oh, this thing looks so sick. Federation outpost. Knowing the populace of the sector, it's likely to be staffed by a mix of crew, including the orchids. Let's contact them, man. Silent orchid beckons for you to come aboard. A human Federation officer welcomes you and asks how they can help. Okay, so we don't need repairs. We don't need fuel. Uh, We don't really need any of this, actually. <laughs> um... Orcas likely have a larger supply. I don't know why it says this. Does this is this like the option that'll give us the most, right? Um, I guess we'll do it. Six missiles, sure. We we didn't need anything else there. Plus, we can maybe sell some missiles if we get lucky. So let's go to the distress and then down. Like fuel is obviously the most useful, but we still just have so much. It's absurd. Okay, we will help to. Uh, well, a distress signal is coming from the surface of a planet near the beacon. A wildfire is spreading towards a small orchid colony, which lacks the resources to extinguish it or evacuate in time. Let's help to evacuate as many civilians as you can. The ecosystem on the Orchid planet is so vulnerable to fire that even your whole crew isn't enough to save the Orchid colony in time. You succeed in helping more hard, hardy individuals, but most of the Orchid seeds and babies are lost to the fire. Yikes. Well, we didn't get anything. That's okay. We tried our best to help. You know, that's all that matters, right? 55 scrap is not a lot, but we do have a lot of stuff to sell. Like the system case, titanium system casing we've been holding on to for ages. Military goods available. Let's... We should consider buying, like, another arm or something like that. Ooh, a crystal. Interesting. Medbay. I think it's never really worth it to spend money to get the medbay. The clone bay, although I don't like it nearly as much, whatever. I'll, I'll use the clone bay. I don't want to buy the medbay. So this comes with a conservative drone, which is not bad. Don't really have enough money. We could sell some stuff. Amp focus. Pretty good, I think. We don't need to buy more crew. We, we have a decent amount of crew now, although I, although I would like a rock or a crystal for sure. I think we just get this online, maybe? Oh, this only takes one, huh? This is the gun that was on the... We had this, right? Um, I'm not a massive fan of it. I think the frost laser is going to be better for us. So, I don't think we need anything. I think we will sell... Honestly, I think we sell the titanium system casing. It's 40 scrap. This at least, it doesn't sell for much. It seems kind of useful. I think this is not, I mean, it's, it's in the base game. We all know this. It's just not that useful. I'd rather just not get hit, and we can do a pretty good job of that by getting engine upgrades, cloaking. And I want to have a space for augments that we may or may not find, so I'm going to eat it. I'm going to eat this. I guess we can keep this for now. But let's swap this out now. We're not going to buy anything, I don't think. We get the drone park crate. Nobody cares. And let's then upgrade our weapons one more, like this. So we now have 
a very good weapon setup, I think. And actually, you know what? While we're here, dude, get some more power. Get those engines up because they are kind of slacking a little bit. And we'll come over here then and just continue on our spacefaring adventure. Let's see what we got. I like this planet with the purple. You gaze out the windows at overgrown orchid... At... Should be an overgrown orchid planet. When a pirate jumps in out of nowhere, it appears conflict is inevitable. Okay, well, let's fight you then. They have a burst laser mark too, which is obviously not something I like to see. But we should be alright. We'll just wait here. Nobody cares. Fire this. Cloak through this. And then get all of our lasers on their shields. And get the focus beam on their weapons. Nice. So now we can just kind of lay into them. This is a really good weapon setup. Jesus Christ, dude. Oh, man. Like, this takes down level 2 shields just immediately for free. It's a beam, so it can't even miss. Oh, my God. So good. And they have extra fuel cells. Again, we're just rolling in fuel. Love to see it. Double distress, huh? One, two, three. Uh, that's kind of ugly. One, two. We go one, two, and then up to this. And then over. I want to hit both these distresses. See what they got for us. Let's try to rescue. It's risky, but we do have a clone bay and a lot of sh a crew. Okay, we got intruded, which is terrible. They refill oxygen, don't they? Okay, well, let's first off just power the clone bay up just in case disaster strikes. Um, They refill oxygen, so we can't really... I think we could still vent them. We don't even have a... All right, here's what we're going to do. We're going to vent everything except this and just try to fight them here. Actually, no. Vent everything. Get you guys in shields, I guess. You. They're breaking oxygen, but they're going to move. Even though they refill oxygen. Oh my god, they didn't move. That's okay. We can get you, because you don't need oxygen, to just fix this. They're dying, so whatever. Uh, Clone Bay is actually... Wait, that's kind of bad. Um, Uh-oh. Uh oh, you gotta fix this. Oh no. Oh no. Okay, if we get auction back online, um, you guys have to come fix this immediately. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Okay, we got the clone bay online. Oh no. <laughs> um, we have clone bay online, so we're not completely screwed. These guys are all gonna die. That's really annoying. Wow, they, they finessed this, dude. That's fine. Again, clone bay's online. You two come fight them, I guess. There goes our entire crew. <laughs> okay, Clone Bay actually kind of saved us there. No cap. No capital. That's fine. Um, you guys, again, are just dying slowly. Jesus Christ, dude. These guys are intense. We can't heal. Dude, all right, whatever. We can't heal, so just go kill yourselves, I guess. You come help. We're just going to throw our crew over and over and... Whatever. All right, we got them. <laughs> Thank God we had a Clone Bay. The, the oxygen refill is actually really difficult to deal with in a different way. That's bizarre. Okay, well, they... they You know what? Fine. We're good. We're good, man. Just let everyone come back to life. We did lose skills for sure. But, I mean, like, look at this. Barely any. He's still almost at max, so it's not really that big of a deal. All right, wait for Kremity to come back. Nice. All right, send everyone home. Yikes. I was really hoping to save some orchids, but I guess they are just a bunch of assholes, so whatever. How's a, How are you doing? You have, like, no pilot skill. Great. Okay. We're gonna go here and then up, right? Well, let's do it. Um. Federation help. Ooh, our station has become overrun with massive man-eating weeds. Uh, well, let's do it. So, we have the clone bait again. Nice. Um, glad we had that online. The Clone Bay has honestly done pretty good work <laughs> this run. I'm not even going to lie. Losing crew is a pain in the ass, but we're holding on. That's why I was a little bit less worried about you doing that event. Alright, finally some actual combat. They got cloaking. Their weapons I'm not too scared of. One, they're probably not going to sink them. Two, we have cloaking. So whatever. Alright, get this going now. Pre-ion. We're going to fire in a moment here. Let's cloak. Nice. Okay, fire the pre-ion. And then, again, just put lasers on shields, beam on weapons. There we go. Boom. This is the, the golden strategy. We can't go wrong, dude. We cannot go wrong. Now, I could put the 
regular laser instead of this to do uh, system damage. But I think the, the speed at which this shoots is actually pretty good for just taking down their whole... Okay, they actually got their shields online very quickly here. <laughs> kind of a bummer. But they will die. Finish them off. This will this will kill them. There we go. Okay. Not bad. I think the focus beam will get switched out for an actual beam at some point, probably. But for now, it, it's doing alright. So we're not going to be going up there. One, two, three, four. Say less. Say less. Seems to be a good good decision here. Okay. Ooh, we got a kernel launcher. You're shocked to see a rundown but still functional Federation outpost stationed at this beacon. They've gone to great lengths to camouflage their hole with orchid paint and fake leaves, but once they recognize you, they offer a weapon to give them a weapon given to them by native orchids. Let's also uh run a salvage mission. Nice. Okay. So this weapon uses kernels of giant plants from orchid plants as ammunition. They pierce shields, but also have a 25% chance to ignore their ammunition cost. Okay, interesting. So they're a missile weapon that has a 25% chance to not cost a missile. That's pretty good. <laughs> um, so it's one power, 10 seconds. It shoots a missile, pretty much. Shoots one shot. 40% um, breach chance and 40% stun chance. It's not bad. Honestly, dude, this might have to get tacked on. It's a shame. I like all four of these weapons. So I don't know where to put it. You know, like, I, I, I want all four of these. May, we'll keep it for now because it's pretty good. And I think maybe what we'll do eventually is swap this out for, like, maybe this will get upgraded to something with more projectiles. This will get swapped out. We can put this in to just have auto-fire missiles going or something. I don't know. Because with 25% con uh, conservation by the flagship, dude, we're, we're going to be rolling. I, I'm pretty happy to get that, actually. I think I'm going to try to use it later on in the run, if possible. Because it seems really good. A large pod drifts by, made partly of organic matter and clearly of orchid design. It could be dangerous, but I'm going to open it. <sighs> Every time, dude. Okay, well, uh, let's get you two to fight, I guess. Actually, no. You stay here. You... What do we do here? <laughs> You move. They do replenish oxygen, yes. They're coming this way. But we can maybe still do some vent damage. <clears throat> you come fight. Just come here and shoot him, I guess. You're probably gonna die. Let's uh let's just power this up to be safe. I mean just get out of here. Whatever, dude. Okay, so they can't replenish it if it's fully empty, which is good. So they're still suffocating. Turn O2 off just to increase the... They're going to take our piloting out. There's nothing we can do. Close this, please. Okay, nice. Turn O2 back on. You come fix this while you're just hanging out. Um, It's kind of difficult to vent this. The airlocks are not anywhere near it. I think we're all right, though. They should die. There we go. He's, one, he's down, and then we just got one more. Just go fight him, I guess. Whatever. I'd rather you not take our shields down. It would be helpful. Nice. Alright, send everyone home. Um, you don't have oxygen yet. I mean, you'll get healed by the clone bay every jump, but I'd rather just wait a second. There we go. Okay. Nice. Turn that back on. I, I, I want to get an orchid, man, but they keep popping out to attack us. I thought they were supposed to be friendly, dude. Unbelievable. Whatever. Okay. A vast, beautiful field of flowers lays on the nearby planet. A stunning view of flowers scattered across miles and miles. Uh, this seems like they're going to get mad at us. I'm going to do it. Oh, wait. As you and your ch uh, crew begin to cheerfully pluck some flowers from the sunny field, an orchid ship descends from the sky. Their crew in tears. Monsters, you slaughter our children. Ugh, I knew something would happen. You have no idea. You had no idea these flowers were young orchids, but it's too late to go back. Yikes. Okay, so they're mad, but we're about to leave the sector, so okay. All right. They have some. They have some weapons. They do have some weapons, indeed. We're going to check that augment out for sure. We're going to cloak through the flak, though, first. So get this ready and fire it. Cloak, please. And then we'll just do our usual here and go like that. Big misses. Nice. <clears throat> All right. Our weapons are down. Pivot to the shields. I do want to keep these down if possible. Come on, Frost Laser. Do some good work here. Nice. Shields are all the way down there. They're screwed, dude. Um, <clears throat> no, sorry. I mean, 
yeah, we kind of threw the first, cast the first stone by, you know, killing their kids, but oh well. So what does this do? The uh, murder bot was really good. The, cor oh, the, <laughs> the corpses of dead orchid children, though they merely resemble small flowers. You can sell them for scrap at the cost of your soul, you monster. Yeah, I'm sorry, you know. But, I mean, I on a morality level, that was terrible. But on a meta level, we got scrap from killing the ship. We got XP for our crew. We got an asset we can sell. I see this as an absolute win. So, I don't know, man. But that's all right. Let's continue. We're about to leave Orchid Space anyways. Let's explore. We will aid the civilian ship. Okay, and we will do nothing. So, we're getting mind controlled. Which is annoying, but they are indoors, which is not that annoying. Um, we're going to be clicking through the swarm missile here in a moment. Let's let our weapons charge up. Okay, this is this is annoying, dude. You're going to have to stop. Um, go for shields. And then do this again and take their weapons out, please. I'd like to take my control out, but please stop. Okay, nice. He didn't break it. Perfect. Keeping those missiles uh, offline is, is much more helpful, in my opinion. <clears throat> and they should be down. Get our doors fixed up here. Perfect. Okay. We're doing great, dude. We are doing great on this run. Civilian ship. Oh, you know what? I'm very happy to have Sophia, the Zoltan. You, it would be good to put you in shields. Kremity has like no shields experience. So we'll put you in shields. And we will move Kremity to, I guess, uh, sensors. Nice. This is, this is going great. I'm happy. Next sector. Off we go. Wrecked territory. I think this is another Lania sector, which is pretty scary, for sure. Um, but there's nothing to be done, so we're going to give it a shot. Yep. Uncolonized. Apparently there are no Lanius here, really. But once the civilian sector was abandoned... Okay, we. this is the same one as last time. Let's contact him. A gruff-bearded human captain. Yes, we see you. What do you want? Let's request. Don't have anything. Okay, well, that's fine. We tried. We will probably come up. We have a lot of money. We do have a lot of money. Getting that power from the Zoltan, by the way. Huge. But I don't think we need any upgrades right now. Maybe shields at some point soon. But I want to save for a store because I think we have a lot of potential by finding a store. But let's see what we got here. Le a level 3 shields. Okay, maybe we should consider some stuff. You nearly make the mistake of attempting to salvage the wreckage at this beacon before realizing it's populated by ghosts. It's already too late. They've noticed you and now move into attack. Okay. Lots of weapons and stuff. They're bringing a ghost over. Where? In here? That's fine. You... Oops, not. You, come help. Get ready. We got cloaks, so we can cloak... Is this... Is this the charge flag? What is this thing? I, I remember seeing it. This is a missile, and then this thing, of course. Okay. Let's fire you on shields. And we'll fire our lasers on here, like this, and do this. Nice. Missile comes in. We cloak. Huge. Okay. Nice. And now we can just kind of lay into them, I think. I do not want to get hit by too many more of their weapons, so I would like to keep them down. Fire doesn't really mean a lot. They're down. Okay. Oof. Nice. Repair cluster. Interesting. We I think we picked this up once before. Repair system damage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Again, it's it takes no power. So it's kind of good, but I, I just, I have, wep like, all four of these weapons I use actively. So it's kind of a bummer. We have too much, uh, we're spoiled by choice here. I need to sell some stuff as well because I just have a full cargo hold. So we really do need a store. You get so much more stuff in Multiverse, which is really cool. Gets you a lot more options. You discover an abandoned mining facility in the process of being acquired by pirate scavengers. However, you immediately receive a call from a civilian transport vessel. Help, we are trying to escape only to be caught by pirates. See a lone pirate ship boarding the civilian craft. Let's attack them. Okay, so they have an energy weapon and an ion bomb, I believe. We kind of need to... We're going to save the pre-ion. God, the music is just... It's turning me up too much. Okay, so just do this with the lasers. We're going to get focus beam as well. Just to take this uh, Zoltan shield down. Cloak through that, I guess. I don't know. Probably should have cloaked through this. Whatever. Okay, turn off auto-fire. Get ready with the pre-ion here. And fire it. And then fire both of these and get the focus beam on their weapons. Nice. Okay. They have an ion bomb still. It comes in into our shields, which is pretty bad. But without this online, we're not really in too much of a problem. 
uh, too much trouble here. Ooh, nice misses. That's fine. Focus Beam does the final bit there. 32 scrap, and they give us nothing. If I, okay, well, that's fine. We're going to come this way. Uh, ah, we have so much money, dude. Ah, we have so much money. Okay, we can sell stuff when we get to a store to get more money. So I think we just go we go uh, shields here. It takes us down quite a bit, but that's okay. We have so many assets to just offload at the next store that we'll be able to get our money way back up. Okay, we haven't found a lot of empty beacons this run. So this pierces. Don't really. I don't think they can hurt us, to be 100% honest with you. I do not believe they can hurt us. I really liked this weapon last time, or whatever. First, That was our first run, wasn't it? Whatever. Do this. Do this, and then do this. See ya. They are in shambles. They're trying to run. I don't think so, dude. I don't think you're going to get far with that. This I will do, actually. Because that's actually pretty helpful this early. And we found a store. Nice. nice. We can go one, two, three, four, five. Ooh, we can't reach. But we can go. We can reach here. So we can go like here, 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 and then down and like across and then up this way. Okay, nice. Hit the store. <clears throat> What do we got? We will, a rebel ship is resting. Yeah, we're, we're going to attack them. Screw a rebel. Nobody cares about them. We get the store first, though, right? Drone control. Wow, nothing. I mean, we could get drone control, I guess. What does it come with? Free amp energy drone. I don't know what that does. <clears throat> we could get a Zoltan shield, dude. Mm, might have to do it, man. Might have to do it. Uh, well, we need to sell something. Th this is good. Uh, we got to sell it. 32 scrap. We got to sell it. Um, I, I don't think there's a universe where we keep this. Like, all of these are going to get replaced by better weapons. This is just, it it's it's done its job. But I don't think, I mean, it's only 10 scrap, but we need this space. And I think we hold on to, uh, do we buy the, the drone control, man? I think people like to see drone control. I think it could be useful. So let's buy it. Well, well, okay, we're gonna kill the ship and then come back to the store. Let's let's just see what we can do here first. This is funny. Okay, so they're sh foolishly shooting this immediately. Okay, get this. Like that. And then do this and focus beam like so. Nice. Cloak. They're trying to run away. Don't foresee that going too well here. Oh, we could delay the fleet further. I don't think we need that, to be honest. I think we've already done a good amount of delaying. Nice. Okay. So we get some more stuff from them. Oh, God. Okay. Um, We have the clone bay. It worked last time, so I'm going to try. <clears throat> this time it worked. We got Kriz. Who is he just... What is he? Is he just a normal human? Uh, not that. This. He's just a human. Okay. I mean, sure. We don't need any more systems to be manned, so you can work in oxygen, I suppose. Actually, you know what we should we should totally do? You should work in oxygen, and you should work in sensors. That way, if oxygen goes down, this guy can just fix it, like, immediately, you know? Which is helpful. Okay. Now. What do we do now? Upgrades? Store? Like, the drone control? Amp energy drone. I think, I think it could be helpful. I think we buy the drone control, just for the for the, the hell of it. What does this thing do? Oh, yeah. It's a ion drone, right? Oh, no. Fires energy projectiles. Oh, that's pretty good, actually. Okay. Well, we may, we may as well put this in here as well. And then may as well get some more power like that. So we can do this, I think. One, two, three, four. And then we're going to come down. Yeah. Okay. This ship is coming along real well. Like, putting this online once we get their shields down seems like a really good idea. Yeah, let's attack them. And change your toggle. So, uh, I should have looked more. I think we can just... I think we're okay with what we got now. Let's do nothing. They cannot hurt us, obviously. Or not obviously, which is awesome. This is just a single dingle, right? Yeah, they, they can't hurt us, so okay. Good stuff. We definitely don't need the amp drone here. 
So we'll fire in a second like that, and then this, and then get focus beam on their... We don't need to go for their weapons, so we may as well do this. Just completely dive in on their shields. They're probably going to cloak again. I guess we can do this. Uh, focus beam already fired, unfortunately. That's fine. And they cloak. There we go. Okay, well, that's fine. Again, they can't hurt us, so nobody cares. We haven't had to use cloaking in so long, because these ships are all so... Like, garbage. <laughs> or maybe we're just super good, really. Is probably what it comes down to. 34 scrap and 20 more. Oh, baby, this is a shaping up to be a real good run. So this is good, but I think this is going to be really good, like I said, for just putting pressure on ships after the fact. So let's go down. We have nine jumps. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, I did not... Oh, that's a misclick. God damn it. <laughs> Fuck. Let's try to... Use... Okay, well, we delayed the rebels further. It's okay. We can... We kind of wasted a jump, but we can still come this way. God, that's so stupid. Whatever. <laughs> I literally misclicked. Oh, well. We're doing all right, though. Lanius Vessel stops repurposing an abandoned satellite as soon as you jump in. It blocks all hails and powers its weapons. Let's do nothing. Okay, they have a lot more weapons, and they're boarding us, which is obviously terrible. So, what do we do about this? We get you two to fight, I think. We power up this. Oh, they're coming in here. Do this. Get you in here as well for that little triple... Fight, I guess. Wish we had an orchid to power up oxygen, but we don't, so oh well. Okay, um let's just fire this. I'm just watching this fight. It's a little bit suspect. Do this, do this, and then take their weapons out because they got a lot. Okay, so we're suffocating, which is bad. Clone base powered up though. Um I'm gonna cloak through this. Yep, seemed like a good idea. I think we're going to be okay, actually. Yeah, I know we're dying. We got a clone bay. It's okay. Especially these three. They don't really have skills I care about. You should move, though. Nice. Okay, that went pretty well, all things considered. Having the phantoms is, is pretty helpful. Alright, these guys are down. Nice. 37 scrap. Hell yes. We're still going to come down this way. 146 is a lot of money, but we don't really need any pressing upgrades right now, I don't think. We're not going to give you any fuel, so we're just going to fight you. Do nothing. Uh, this is annoying. That is for sure. They're boarding us again. Oh, they have... I don't know what this guy is. They split up, though? Where are you going? Oh, God. Okay. Um. You come help. You come... Uh, I don't want you to come, really. God, the being boarded... We, we should get the door upgrade. That's definitely something we should do. So they're coming into Clone Bay. You and you come in here. We can't let them break this. Oh, holy shit, our guy's gonna die immediately. That's okay, he'll he'll come back with... Uh... Oh, shit, this is kind of bad. Okay, we need more people in there. We gotta get engines in here. We gotta fire then on um, shields. We just can't let them kill the clone bay while we're cloning people. Okay, that's down, which is good. They have a lot of energy weapons. Also, what is this ship? It looks crazy. It's like a rainbow. I, I was... Barely paying attention. Do this. Do this. Okay. So our, our crew's dying. If this guy could unmind control, that would be really helpful, by the way. Really, really helpful. Really helpful, dude. How long is he going to be mind controlled? Oh my god. We're going to have to just keep bringing more people in until the this guy becomes unmind controlled, which is just not happening. Okay, we got another guy in there. Dude, stop. stop. I mean, I could have shot my control, but I assumed he would be not. It's been so long. Ignore their cries. Okay, they beam back. Our NG died, of course. He's finally on my control. Unbelievable. All right, getting... Ooh, Guardian Drone 1. Nice. Getting a door upgrade is something I'm going to be doing right away because I've, I've had enough with these borders, man. Just let our crew come back here. Is there a store? No. All right, get the door upgrade. Jesus Christ, man. I think that guy must have been like a crazy combat cyborg or something. Maybe not. Maybe he's just a human. He looked funky, though. <clears throat> Alright, so you lost some skill, or you're going to lose some skills here. Um, Come on. You're still... You're okay. Whatever. Okay, we're moving. We're moving. 
Let's continue. Like combat wise, we're fine. It was just the borders that were making it really difficult. Plus the MV, <clears throat> excuse me, the MV ships are pretty kitted most of the time. All right, we got Alanius here. Do nothing. Again with the mind control. I, I, I want to buy mind control next. I think. Maybe hacking though. We only have one more system, so <clears throat> I think mind control could be more useful to un mind control. It's every ship in multiverse has mind control. It's crazy. All right, just keep doing that, dude. Props to you, man. Blow up our own doors, why don't you? Here comes a missile. Give it a sec, then we cloak through this one as well. And then we'll fire pre-ion on... Not, no, 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 no. I guess we could. doesn't really matter. Here. And then do this. And get this ready. They both missed. Huge. Nice. Okay. There we go. Fix the doors that you... So unceremoniously destroyed. Pivot this to weapons, because I don't want to take too many lasers here. Or missiles. Alright, we're taking another missile, probably. Hit nothing, that's fine. That's that's We haven't taken too much damage in a while, so I'm okay with that. We gotta take the neural laser, dude. We gotta take it. It's a stun laser, right? Three lasers, each which do one damage and stun crew. It does takes two power, but it shoots three lasers. Does it do system damage? <clears throat> does it do system damage? Um... This does negative one system damage, which means it doesn't do system damage. So I think this must, right? So I think this has got to be better than the Frost Laser, dude. It takes the same amount of power. It doesn't have the lockdown ability, but it does stun. It charges faster and it has one more projectile, dude. I think I think we got to have this, dude. Right? Surely. Ooh, I wish I could have gone to that. I can't, though. That's okay. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, what is this? Sun, oof. Uh, that's fine. Okay, let's let's try out the stun laser. I'm excited. Uh, we'll definitely do this. I mean, again, I don't need more fuel, really, but I don't need missiles at all. One, two. I oh, don't know. One, two, three. Yeah. I really just don't need missiles. Um, at least that many. Seems a nearby militia ship trying desperately to protect the sector has made a mistake and identified you as a scavenger. You don't have time to explain because they've muted comms and are moving in quickly. Okay, let's do nothing and attack them. Uh, they have a quad border. Oh my god, he still hasn't fixed our doors. Wow, that's annoying. I honestly was not paying attention. Well, that's a bummer. Okay, get you in here, get you in here, get you in here, and just, we gotta body this guy. <clears throat> Zoltan is getting his ass kicked. That's fine, I think we just move him. I, I don't want him to lose skills. All right, we'll fire, though. Do this. Do this and this, and then do this. Nice. It's pretty much a burst laser mark, too. Just, okay, they beam back, send everyone home. Nice. No, not going to do that. Hell yeah, dude. It misses. Uh, was that? I still feel like there's some sort of, certain weapons have, like, hard-coded miss chances. Like, I have no proof, but I just feel like certain weapons just miss way more than others. I'm probably just completely, you know, being dumb, but I don't know, man. It's just a feeling I get. Okay, right. We already wasted a jump here. Bummer. One, two, and then three. Okay. Bum, bum, bum. So much money, but again, we don't really need to spend it. Ooh, okay. Well, drone parts. Uh, we're just going to do scrap, honestly. This is a cool looking ship. I don't need more fuel. I don't need missiles at all. So scrap is, is always a good shout there. Okay. Here's the sun. Let's do nothing. They have a lot of flak, but with cloaking, these will probably fire at the same time so we can cloak really, really easily. Dun, dun, dun. Cloak. 90% dodge is obviously not perfect. Still pretty good though. We'll do this and focus on their weapons. Nice. Breach is huge, because I gotta fix that first. There we go. Their flak got taken down. It's back up, though. Oh, baby. Nice. Here comes the fires. We have all of our shields, though, so we probably will be alright. It's kind of an ugly-ass spot, not gonna lie. Dude, the, the airlocks on this ship are crazy weird. You don't take fire damage, right? So just put that out yourself, I guess. And we'll go to the exit. Get away from this sun. Let's explore. 
colonized moon. However, scan showed has been abandoned. You also detect an abandoned space station near the beacon. Let's move in. Stripped clean. Okay, great. You doing alright here, man? You gonna be able to put this out? Yep. Nice. Alright, next sector. Uh, civilian core worlds or central shipyards. I think I'm gonna go to the core worlds. It gives us more options for the next jump, and it's, uh, well, they're both special sectors, I guess, but we're gonna go here. And we unlocked on a wing and a prayer. This is sector five, right? So we got the multiverse cruiser slot A. Nice. That will be, we'll check that out uh, at some other point. Okay, well, thank you guys so much for watching. That was episode two. We are moving on to episode three next time. So I will see you guys around. Thank you so much for tuning in.